If you drive by these properties, as you go one property to the next to the next, you'll see most of them are just open fields. So for me, the exciting part was when I drove, I'm like, holy cow, this is actually set up for horses. And I mean, anyone that's actually tried to fence, cross fence, put those things up, you know how much time, effort, and money goes into doing it. So to be able to just have it all set up and be able to bring your horses here and move in, I, just, I know there's a buyer that's gonna be really excited about that. Everything on this home is faced towards the south side of the home, so you get that daylight. It, it really utilizes all the sunlight that you get. We got a full day of sunlight because being in the east-west valley as opposed to the Okanagan where it's north-south, we, we don't lose it early and we, don't, we get it early and we keep it late sort of thing. And even though I can't list this as a riverfront property, I really would love to because you, you've got the property, then you've got Shoe Shop Road, and then it just goes right into shoreline. So I mean, all you're looking is down the line to the river. And when that river comes up in the spring and summer, I mean, you've got paddle boarding, you've got kayaking, there's amazing walking trails and hiking trails down there. And there's a ton of horse trail properties as well. So I work at the South Thompson Inn. Um, it's a 57 room inn um, located on the South Thompson River. I'm not too far from this property. We have a restaurant that opens at 5 o'clock every night. It's called Madison's. Um, we also have the Bourbon Lounge. If you have out-of-town guests and you don't want to have them stay in your home because you don't want somebody here for a week, then we're just down the road. Right next door to the South Thompson Inn is the Rivershore Golf Course. It's a championship golf course. It is one of the top 100 in BC. You've got Rivershore Golf Course. You've got the um, South Thompson Inn. You've got the wineries, which in my opinion is makes some of the best wine in all of BC. We're semi-arid. We don't have the big lake, like the Okanagan Lake. And so we, we get the real, you know, real cold nights, really hot days in the fall. And that, especially in the whites, it really brings out the flavor. And so, and that's what you need. And that same thing like, like wherever it's Napa Valley or anything like that, you have to have that, you know, cold nights and hot days. And we get, we get the more extremes here than you do in the Okanagan and that's what makes our wines better. The landscape is really incredible because uh, you have desert, but also you have really green parks. So it's, you have both, and in winter it's a lot of snow and you can do a lot of things here. I spend weeks with most homes trying to get it to show uh, fraction is as nice as this one does. So when people walk in, it's just gonna feel like home. All the big stuff has been done. Everything's been really well cared for. The master bedroom goes directly back to the um, deck. So you can basically grab your coffee, go straight from the bedroom out to the deck, sit there, enjoy the sunlight. Um, you've got a ton of daylight. You've got the extra rec room downstairs. So when you walk in, you see the house and you see a triple car garage. You're like, oh, that's amazing. Then you go back behind the triple car garage and you find the detached shop that was built in 2006. So, I mean, if, you've, if you're a mechanic, a woodworker, anything like that, you've actually got the shop and then you still have the three cars for your toys. We have a young family and such too. And one of the things I love about this is we have the school bus right on the road in front of us. And, you know, it's, and it's very safe out here. All the neighbors, you know, there's quite a few that also have young children going to school and people tend to watch out for, you know, everybody's children, so to speak. Right now, there's two horses comfortably. You could fit up to four horses onto, onto the property. Um, there's hydro, there's water already running out there, so it's completely turnkey. It's set up properly. Any horse lover is going to have a true appreciation for how it's set up back there.